Immigration is a central issue in Britain's parliamentary election campaign, which nears a climax tonight with a TV debate. To keep his job, Prime Minister Gordon Brown must do well in that and overcome the embarrassment of a major campaign gaffe. CBS News correspondent Richard Roth is in London with more. Good morning, Richard. Hi, Betty. Well, with the election just a week away, just about everyone is uh, calling this a campaign train wreck. Hi, how are you doing? Good to see you. If Gordon Brown got up today figuring, well, that was yesterday's news, the papers this morning would have quickly changed his mind. It's very good to meet you. It was supposed to have been the sort of ordinary encounter with a voter yesterday, in this case, 66 year old Gillian Duffy, that was supposed to demonstrate the candidate's common touch. And when Duffy raised the hot button issue of immigration. But all these Eastern Europeans were coming in. Uh, Where are they flocking no, from? Brown did what politicians do. He practiced politeness. But how he really felt became clear when he got into his car and did what politicians aren't supposed to. He forgot he was wearing a live microphone and he spoke his mind. That was a disaster. She just a sort of bigoted woman. The words got back to Jillian very quickly. You're joking. Because, I mean, how do you feel about that? Where was I a bigot? By the time he got into a radio studio, you could read his body language. Of course, I apologize if I've ever said anything that is that has uh, been offensive. And I would even if he weren't already battling a reputation as bad-tempered with a tendency to bully staff, this would have qualified as a bad day for the prime minister. Tonight at six, the two faces of Gordon Brown, a major embarrassment on the campaign trail. And here he comes. Here he is now. Brown went statement. back to visit Gillian Duffy again and apologize in person. He wasn't wearing a microphone. Gillian Duffy is now uh, Britain's Joe the Plumber in this campaign, and she's hired her own PR representative. They're saying here that Brown could use a new one. Betty? CBS's Richard Roth in London. Thank you, Richard. A lot happens early on The Early Show, weekday mornings on CBS.